Hello, this is Pastor Jean Kim from San Jose Bible Baptist Church. I'm sure many of you are wondering how the church and I are doing in this shelter in place. As you might know, from what the governor of California and our counties wanted to do is that the churches would shut down and they strongly recommended where people would uh, stay at home. So because of that, it's pretty much mandatory and uh, churches are not running. A lot of them are switching to online platforms, but fortunately on our end, we've been doing it for years. So because of that, the Lord's been good to us. So we will have an online services. So you will see Sunday service posted at 12 p.m., but it will only be one service. Wednesday service will run at 7 p.m., and that will only be one service as well. So nothing has changed in the schedule except that Sundays and Wednesdays, they only have one service. As far as individual clips are concerned, where you see me post videos or small little clips every single day, that will still be ongoing. You will not see me drawing on the whiteboard. However, you will see me in this type of office setting, and you will see me show you articles, documents on my computer. So I'll be screen recording the whole thing with the webcam so that you can see me in the office. So I think that'll be a new environment to some of you, which might be excited to see the actual documentations, the scripture verses that I read, and you can see them together. For those of you who are somewhat disappointed without the drawing board, it will return one day, Lord willing. But for now, this is the setup that the Lord designed and allowed us to do. For our church, if some of you are wondering, most of our members are doing well. We have been prepared and expected something like this to happen. And we're helping each other. We've been communicated. We've been communicating in the WhatsApp social chat group. If any of you are my church members and you have not gotten into WhatsApp, please get involved in the WhatsApp group so that you can be able to keep up to date on what we're doing as a church. You have my number, so please contact my number. Those of you who are online, obviously you will not get that WhatsApp group social chat platform or my phone number. I also want to let my church members know, not the onliners, but my church members know that we have a Zoom platform. Please download Zoom into your laptop so that we can be able to communicate with each other so that if we have any issues or problems, we can help one another. So as you can see, our church has been well prepared and we're keeping everything going to serve the Lord while staying at home. And uh, we're watching for each other, helping each other with food, supplies, resources, and a lot of other things. And so that we can stay in touch and in fellowship as well. So the Lord's been good to us despite of uh, what the devil might do or the elites or whoever's running the show trying to do where we're not able to serve God together. No, till the rapture, Lord willing, we will keep doing our part. So you'll see us online. Uh, as usual, Sunday, Wednesdays, and every day you will see a miniature video clip where I'm teaching to you, showing you all the stuff in my computer. I'm sure you'll be excited about that. Lord bless you all. Please pray for us and our church uh, during these this time of crisis. But pray that we'll be found faithful and that we'll still minister to you. You people have not been forgotten, and I'm doing well on my part. Let's all pray together and keep doing what we're supposed to do. For some of you who have not yet watched the video, I have a video sermon that I preached at Sunday. It was uploaded this week at Monday. This week at Monday, the, servant, the service was uploaded. It's called Coronavirus, End of the World, What Will Happen? If you can watch that video, I'm sure it can be very helpful to many of you who are worried or troubled about these this time of crisis dark times we desperately need god so i hope that the sermon will help you because it has it has helped me and a lot of people in my church which is why we have been ready for something like this lord bless you